what's up YouTube squad gaming back with another episode on the channel and this time we will be playing some NCAA football 14 you can see on the screen now I have updated rosters throughout the NCAA and this should be fun I've always wanted to get back into college football games but they haven't been released at all lately so it's back to NCAA 14 but luckily I was able to find the updated rosters and let's get this dynasty going as you can see I'm playing on Heisman and as you'll soon find out I'm playing on sliders that I got from YouTube I'll leave the link in the description down below if you guys want them they're really nice sliders I enjoy playing on them but I'll be taking over my home state Iowa Hawkeyes Iowa Hawkeyes are led by Kirk Ferentz the head coach so I'll be sticking with that and this team is pretty good. I'm hoping I can do some good things with them. C.J. Beathard, starting quarterback, and LaShawn Daniels at running back. We should have a pretty good season and a pretty good team with some veteran leaders. And I think we'll be a really nice team and hopefully finish in the top 25. The question marks on this team would be the offensive line is not as good as they have been in past years, along with the linebacking core. Both of these have been some question marks through spring. And now coming into the season, they are also still question marks. But this team has really been on the downfall lately. Kirk Ferentz has, given, has been given a lot of hate, and we don't know how long he'll be here anymore. But in this dynasty, we're going to get Kirk Ferentz back to the top and where Iowa should be. With a nice secondary, I feel like we'll shut down the pass. And the defensive line, we can shut down the run. The offense will take care of itself with the pro-style pro offense. But we'll see how these guys get on. Hopefully, to start the season, we will play some weaker non-conference opponents and get us going. Right here, I'll show you the players that I'm redshirting really fast. I really like LaShawn Daniels Jr. He's going to be one of the key players in this dynasty. Someone that should lead this team very far. I believe that Bethard can really get the damage done on the offense to lead this team far. Jake Rudock was the starting quarterback in previous years. But he decided he'd transfer to Michigan and take his talents there. That's okay for Iowa though because Jake Rudock kind of struggled at Iowa. They really expected him to be a big prospect for him and lead them in the future. But he left us and it's up to CJ Bethard who has stepped in the role before and done better things than Jake Rudock. Hoping he can get on like he has before and he's only going to get better. The rest of this team is a normal Iowa team. They're tough, strong, can get after it, and that's exactly what they'll do. That's what I'm trying to find this recruiting process as you see me scouting these players. I want some wide receivers. I can do some things on the outside that Iowa hasn't seen before with some speed and stuff. Because usually Iowa does not go after top prospects, and it's frustrating as a fan to see all these other teams get three star, four star prospects, and we're down in the lower stars picking those players up and having to develop them. I want players that can come in and play now. That's exactly what I'm trying to find out of these prospects right here. But to start the season, we'll be playing Northern Illinois, then Western Michigan, I believe, and then the rivalry game, Iowa State. I put in custom conference conferences to get the realistic conferences that should be there. Now as we head into practice, You'll see that this team really likes to run the pro style offense. LaShawn Daniels should have a good season here. Find some big offensive linemen that can do good things. We got tight end and Jake Doozy that can go get the ball. Receivers like Tavon Smith, who has some speed on the outside and can really catch the long ball and go get it. But we also have the receivers like Hillier, Jacob Hillier, who can really catch the ball and run some good routes for us out there. But all in all, I think. This team really needs to get the explosiveness, and that's what I'm trying to recruit for. We have no explosive receivers or anything like that, and that's what Iowa's been missing for a long time now. The defense has always came through with the defensive line. Corners are very nice this year with King and Gare and people like that. Jordan Lomax at free safety. But this team should be good. It's all about how far can we get and if we can develop fast enough to get there. Week one. Northern Illinois will be up in a couple days. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. See ya.